Friends, on this Christ the King Sunday, as we transition from the joy of Thanksgiving to the hopeful anticipation of Advent, let us turn our hearts inward. Let us reflect sincerely on our journey with our Christ the King. In moments of plenty, in times of, in times of need, have we reflected His compassion and grace? In times of uncertainty and chaos, have we looked to our sovereign Christ for hope and spread the peace to our neighbors? As we approach this time of confession, may this time be a time of genuine introspection and renewal. And let us seek forgiveness for our doubts and stubbornness and find encouragement in our Christ's boundless love and mercy. So please join me in the prayer of confession, first together and then in silence. God of all creation, you have crafted us to live in faith and freedom, but we live with tightness in our chest. You have called us to move into a direction, but we cling to the path we know. You have called us to reach outward in love, but afraid we draw inward for protection. You have called us to live with abandon, in trust, but we live carefully, calculating each cost. God, forgive us. Fashion us into the likeness of Jesus Christ, in whom we trust and in whose name we pray. Amen. Friends, hear the good news. In Christ, our sovereign King, grace abounds. Through his life, death, and resurrection, we are forgiven and reconciled to God. As the Lord of history and judge of all, Christ extends to us mercy and grace unending. So let us rejoice and be glad, for in Jesus Christ, we are forgiven. In him, the forces of evil are overcome, and his kingdom of peace and justice is our eternal home. Thanks be to God. Amen.